Looney Farm Guy here with a new mod test for Farming Simulator 22 and this is Old Grain Mill by Leo Leo 17.25 megabytes to download 30 slots on console. I'm on PS5 here on Rock Crawl. And where do we find this? It's under production and factories. And here it is, Grain Mill in the menu here. Uh, as I said, 30 slots for the first one, $50,000 to place down. And what does it do? Well, let's look at our production chain. It, it makes flour from wheat, barley, oat, or sorghum. Uh, the uh, capacity for, for um, raw product is 200,000 liters. So you can see here, I have actually four of them set up and they each have a different product in it because um, I'm slowly learning how to test these things easily and so let's go in here and they all have uh, recipes the wheat is five five in four out at 3600 per month right barley 30 in 23 out at 600 a month okay that's different again oat 15 in out uh, 19 out at 1200 a month and then sorghum 1200 cycles 15 in 16 out so why I did this was this way we can tell yeah we're gonna turn on the wheat we're gonna turn on the barley we're gonna turn on the oat and finally the sorghum and see which one or how much of each one after a month they produce and this way you know exactly which one is the fastest or the most efficient all that kind of stuff split into four separate factories and the we will set them all to distribute so it will keep it inside it's not going to spawn and then uh, and then we can show it spawning distributing distributing there we go so now it's all going to be internally stored and is it already started yet yeah, they're already starting to chug it out and some of them are faster than others it would seem so you can already see some of them are yeah and so once we go we're going to go ahead a month and then we're going to turn one of them on and see how they spawn out here and just so you can see that they also have the trigger here like so um as for decoration well nicely decorated as you can see here but the, the main concern of this video is how does it perform right so we're going to cut away and come back and we will show you what the results are all right, here we are, one month ahead, and what is the results? Yes, all right, so for wheat, we have used, well, not a whole lot of wheat, uh, but we have produced 14,000 liters of flour. Now, as for barley, barley looks like it was a little bit slower. We're only at 13.5 uh, oats. Uh, oats is producing quite well at 22.4 and then sorghum um, just under that so they're all fairly close together um, for actual um, production per month oat being the best now as you can see the capacity is only 30,000 liters so but you are safe after a month and so let's go into here and let's set this to storing and we should see there we go it already has popped out so three only that seems somewhat small for ah uh, yeah so i would have liked a larger spawn area being to be able to clear off Having only three pallets per spawn area seems a bit small to me, but... Oh, and by the way, this spout does nothing. Uh, I've put trailers underneath it. It's just a decoration. 
I thought I thought maybe oh you could take you know if you you want want some grain out but once it's in there it's in there you can't get it out unless you make it make flour out of it so just be aware of that if you fill up your grain or your flour mill with grain um, it's not coming out unless you make it into flour and that's pretty much it that's the old grain mill by Leo Leo 17.25 megabytes to download and um, oh yes 72 cents uh, 72 dollars per month production uh, fee uh, doesn't say oh daily upkeep is forty dollars so there you go I'm Lonely Farm Guy. Thank you all for watching, and uh, don't forget, it's only a game. So till next time, bye for now.